Hello everybody, my name is Miss Burkett and today we get to make a piece of really cool wintry birch snow art together. So what you're going to need is a sheet of black, dark blue or purple cardstock or you can use construction paper too. Um, some paint and white and then different shades of blue, purple and um, blue, purple, and uh, I have some dark green kind of turquoise colors here, but anything in that kind of color spectrum will work. And then some old book pages, newspaper pages, or magazine pages that you can cut strips out of. You're going to need some scissors to cut the strips. Now, this is a really good way for a um, older preschooler to practice their fine motor skills. Uh, if you're a younger preschooler, feel free to help them with cutting the strips out. And then some glue, either a bottle of school, school glue, a glue stick, or a tube of glue. All right, let's get started. Okay, so my first step is that I'm going to take some of these colors. So some blue, different blues, um, some purple, and just finger paint those on there. I'm just kind of, I'm going to do this kind of swirly look here. So you want to use kind of purpley, dark blue, turquoisey kind of colors. And then once you have your swirls painted, where you have some fun colors in the background. I love finger painting, isn't that fun? I'm going to just let it dry. So I'm going to add a few more swirls here and then I'm going to let my paint dry. Now while the paint is drying I'm going to cut some strips from my um, old book pages or magazine pages. Okay and so now I'm going to glue these strips on here and I don't care if they go all the way to the bottom because I'm going to put some snow there later. See, I have some skinnier ones and some wider ones. And then I'm, I cut some other strips that I'm going to use for branches. So I'm just going to glue those on. Okay. And then um, our last step once the glue has dried is I'm going to go back with my paint and this time I'm going to use the white and just dab on some snowflakes all over where my birches are. And then I'm going to finger paint a snowy hill down here. And if you want to, you can put a little bit of the purple or the blue down in there too. That looks fun, doesn't it? I like the bit of blue in there, so I'm going to go ahead and keep that. I'm going to add a few more snowflakes. If you want to, again, you can mix in some blue. There we are. It's all finished. Our wintry birch art project. 